Hey guys, it's Abby and today I have the, the Ipsy Plus for October 2020. This month it is the Your Magic theme. It says, with a pinch of shimmer and a wave of mascara wand, this month cast a spell on yourself. Whether it's nailing the perfect smoky eye or taking that big life leap, let your intuition guide you to your goals. Hashtag Ipsy Magic, October 2020. I got this for PR. If you don't know what Ipsy is, it's a beauty subscription. They have three subscriptions. They have the Ipsy Glam Bag, which you get five, you get five sample size products, and that is $12 a month. You get, they also have the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, which is what I'll be reviewing for you today, and you get 25 and that's $25 a month and you get five full size products. And then there's the Ipsy Ultimate, which is a lot of products. And I don't know how many it is, but there's sample size and full size in there. And I've never been, been a big fan of Ipsy Ultimate. I buy it every month, but I've never been a big fan. So this month I'm gonna show you guys, well, th in this video, I'm gonna show you guys the plus that they sent me for review, but I'm still going to be showing you guys the ones that I got for myself that are on my profile. So I'm going to show you guys what I got and let's begin. This is what the box looks like when it comes in the mail and let's open it up. Okay. So there are a few extra things in here. I'm assuming they're extra because I have these two, which I never ever get stuff like this at all. So I'm just going to show you guys these quick things first, because this could be just like an, an Ipsy Studios thing, you know, for PR, but let's see. So this is an eye mask and it's very soft, super soft and it's not too tight. It doesn't look good. I can't tell. I have no idea. We got, I got this little eye mask, super cute. It's very soft, very silky. And then I also got this and this is Ipsy Your Magic. Oh, it's a candle. Oh, okay, so I got a candle right here. How cute. Ooh, it smells lovely. Kind of smells like laundry detergent. It's a black candle, and I love them. I love candles, any kind. Kind of smells like a man. Like a really smelling delicious man. Yes, okay, so we got this. All right, so now into the bag this month. So the actual bag looks like this. And it is a, I want to say a duffel bag, but I, oh, it's a drawstring bag. That's what it is. We got a drawstring bag. It says your magic on the back. And it has this on the front. I really like the theme this month. I love anything to do with magic. I think it's really great. I love, I just love the whole theme. The actual Ipsy glam bag looks like this this month. And I really like this one too. So the two bags this month are these. Super cute. I really like them. All right, so let's go through the products. The first thing I'm gonna open up is this. And this is vegan, cruelty-free, hypoallergenic, and synthetic. Okay, so these, this is by LaRousse Beauty. And it's just an envelope. I think these are brushes, if I am correct. Oh yeah, these are brushes. Oh, okay. So we have, I think these are like super duper fancy brushes, like very expensive. Let me look on here and see. Eight. It literally says Abby brush set and it says A-B-B-Y, how I spell my name. That is so funny. I don't think it is. Oh wait, nope, this isn't the brush set. I got all excited for no reason. I can't find it. But anyway, these are super expensive brushes. So we have this nice big powder brush right here, really soft. It's not super dense, but it's very soft. It kind of feels like a chinchilla just being real, um, super soft. Then we have this weird looking one right here. Um, I think this is like to carve out your cheekbones, but I don't know, I could be wrong. And then we have this one right here. This looks like a buffer brush or a foundation brush, but I think it's a buffer. Oh, it's a kabuki. Okay, so it'd be foundation. Oh, wait a minute. This is a flat angle. The weird one is a flat angle. That is not flat, but it's a flat angle. And this one is tapered face. This one is kabuki. And I mean, it's very, this one's nice and dense. And then we have this one. And this one is the contour blending brush. This is a brush that I would use underneath my eyes to blend out all the banana powder that I overuse. So here we go. All right, so we got four brushes. I like them. They're nice, they're nice and soft. 
and um, I'll definitely use them for sure. Okay, the next thing is this. This is the Phil Philogra Youth Performance Oxygen Glow for your eyes. So this is an eye moist an eye cream, and I hear Philogra is very expensive. Let's see. This is twenty nine dollars. So we have an eye cream. And oh, that's a baby. It says super smoothing radiance eye care. I love anything that has to do with eyes for real. Like if I got an eye cream every month, I wouldn't be mad because eyes are super sensitive and you need to take care of them. So I got this. I'm, I'm happy about this. Then I got the Ciate London Extraordinary Translucent Powder. And this is just a translucent powder and it retails for $22. The packaging is really, really pretty. I'm not a huge fan of this translucent powder. I know a lot of people like it. I've never been a big fan of it, but I do like their pressed translucent powder, the watermelon one. I actually really like that one. So I'm gonna put this aside for a giveaway. Um, but it's just a really light white translucent powder. Packaging's absolutely adorable. So we got this. Okay, the next thing is this, and this is the Illuminati Quad Palette. And I don't think I have any of the Illuminati eyeshadows. I don't even think I know who they are. Oh, just dropped it. And it's really pretty, actually. Okay, so here we go. I don't see a price for these, so maybe these are just for Ipsy, but they are really beautiful. Aren't they pretty? I love this shade right here. So let's swatch. I'm really happy that this is the this is one of them that I got. I do have swatches on my hands from another product, but I can't get it off. It won't come off, so. Okay, so here are the swatches. They didn't swatch great. I'm not really sure if these are actually shimmer shadows. Like that one is a yellow shimmer and it didn't really like swatch at all. And then that's the lightest shadow right there. So I'll have to play with this and see how it works because this yellow one, it looks beautiful when you swatch it like that, but when you put it on your skin, it's like more glitter, I think. So I'll definitely tell you guys if I like this or not in another video, possibly. And the last but not least is the Huda Beauty Mauve Obsessions palette. I got this palette from Ipsy a long time ago. I think like two years ago, maybe. You guys remember when they were, um, in Ipsy. This became my favorite palette. I've used it to death. I'm at pan for every single shadow, so I'm super, super glad I got another one. This is actually what's on my eyes today, which is so funny because I haven't used that palette in quite a while, and I decided to use it today, and I ended up getting it in the plus. This is such a good palette. This is the Huda Beauty Mob Obsessions, and these are $27. This is such a good one. Like, out of all the palettes, this is one, the one that I would want to get because it's so good. So it just looks like this, and I think you get nine shadows. Yep. So they have a mirror right here, and here are the shadows. Really beautiful. Super, super pretty. I'm so glad to get another one. I have used the other one so much, like I was scraping pan today. How funny is that? I really didn't know this was going to be in there. Actually, you don't get to know what is coming in your box. Like, for us, when we pick our products, we get to see like a, we can see what's coming in our boxes because we pick, we pick some and we can see them. Like it shows you in your account. For Ipsy Studio, you don't get to see what they're sending you. So it's like a surprise. And I had no idea I was gonna get the Mauve Obsessions palette. So here are these shades. Oh, they're so pretty. This is just such a great palette really pretty. They blend really great. They do have quite a lot of fallout, but I hear fallout really isn't that bad. People used to say it was bad, but now they're saying that it isn't. Um, I never mind fallout because it's, I usually put banana powder underneath my eyes while I'm doing my, my eyeshadow so I can sweep everything away. But, um, this is really good. Great, 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 great. This is a great palette. I'm super excited about this. Um, let me know what you guys get in your Ipsy glam bag. All right. So for the month of October, I got the Huda Beauty Mob Obsessions palette, the Filigra little eye cream, the translucent powder. I got the Illuminati quad palette, and then I also received these four brushes from La Ruse. La Ruse. 
and um, the bag this month. The bag is this this month. So I think it's really cute. It's just like a thin fabric bag, but you can reuse this. I like to use these these bags when I do laundry for socks or underwear so I don't get them lost in the laundry, but that's just me. All right, guys, that is it for today for the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. Let me know what you thought about it. Let me know what you get in yours. Um, and I'll make sure to link everything in my description box down below so you can go check everything out for yourself. And that is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. I love you guys so, so much. If you like this video, please, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.